I secured the bag. <laughs> I keep having so many stories upon stories. Hi guys, so as you can tell, I am unpacking and we are in the new house and I'm really excited. If you can tell, it's a smaller room and I'm actually really happy about that because as you guys saw in my other video, I have a hoarder problem, but not anymore, I don't think feel like because so far it's going pretty well and the organizing is getting done. Anyways, let me show you a bit of my room. First of all, I really love this lighting. Like the one thing I really love about this house, well it's not a house, it's an apartment, whatever, it's a home, um, is the lighting. Like I don't need a lamp and I think that's really exciting. So these are the lights. Um, there's like one, two, three, four, and I have a fan in my room now, so that's pretty cool. And there's a light on there. And what's really, really cool is that there's a little remote right here for the fan and I feel really fancy about it and it's just really exciting like I love this like I love this lighting I don't even look too orange I don't look too like blue it's like a pretty nice color and I'm really really excited if you guys did or did not know I went to school at FITM and we learned about lighting so this is why I'm excited about lights I've been tackling the closet over there um, let's just go look at it because to show you guys get some a little vlog footage Anyways, this is how I organize it. So these are like my sleeveless ones. I have denim I kind of try to do it in like color Color coordinating then I have patterns like all my flowers and then I have stripes more flowers my plain ones and then my long dresses These I'm trying to figure out what to do with if I should keep them in here or if I should put them in these drawers under my bed because I actually, they, thankfully in this um, house I have like a lot more room. So like room as in like storage and I will show you. So that was my room. And this is my hallway section with all the stuff I need to organize. But I have these little cabinets here. And then there's my bathroom. It's like a Jack and Jill bathroom which is pretty cool. So that means I can go in from like the front of it or the side of it. And yeah, I'm really excited. I, ah, as you can tell, I have like a nice big mirror. This comes all the way out. So this whole wall is a mirror. And I love that because who doesn't love looking at themselves? <laughs> um, and in the old place, I had this big mirror right here. And I'm trying to figure out what to do with it. Um, I feel like I want to put it in the hallway because that would be nice in case I'm like running out and I need to know what I look like. Um, and then like right now, it's just kind of like so many mirrors. Um, I do love it though because it does open up the space and make it look bigger. My room is a very interesting shape, I will say. So, as maybe you can tell or not tell, but this right here is a square. And then over there, it goes like at a diamond and then it's slanted all the way to here. So I thought that was very interesting. And that's why my bed looks closer to the wall here than over there. I'm trying to figure out what to do with my makeup desk. I, I really want it to be in front of the window so I have like natural lighting. So I'm thinking of putting it in the little corner over there. But now that I'm thinking about it, I think I might just push it over. So then there'll be more room for me to walk. For the shoe rack, I don't know if I want to keep it here or put it somewhere else. But for now, that's what's happening. I really, my main priority today was just to make the bed. So I have somewhere to sleep. I really like this sweatshirt. <laughs> I did wash it, so don't worry. Um, before I, I came to the new place, but I really, really like it. It's very comfy. It was only like, I think like five or six dollars from Forever 21, so that was perfect. Oh, if you guys saw in my video, I was using this triangle as a scissors or like knife because I don't know where my scissors are at the moment or my knife so I'm just using this really sharp triangle I had from school so I thought that was funny because I'm like trying to cut these little boxes open with a triangle. On another exciting note, my first meal in my new apartment is Chipotle. Um, it was like the easiest thing and like I didn't eat like all day like I had a banana this morning and some avocado toast around like 7 a.m. and then I didn't eat the rest of the day other than maybe some water and some Sprite and then the movers were done around like 3 
and then I went to go home to the other place to get some other stuff and then I went to Target to get some stuff and then I went to Chipotle because I was like hey I feel like Mexican but I don't feel like tacos and this was like the easiest the cheapest and the most food I could get so yeah I got this is like leftover right now because I was eating it earlier but obviously I did not finish it and it looks kind of gross we can sit down together and have a little mukbang together and talk about our day is this how they do it I had a pretty exciting and tiring day um the movers came at like eight moved all the stuff also what's annoying is that today well, I live in LA and it never rains it's always sunny and nice and it's raining today and it's really windy and the rain came down so hard now unlike like regular like LA people I actually know what rain looks like I know how to drive in the rain it rain doesn't really bother me but it obviously it bothers everyone else so we're moving and all of my stuff is soaking wet soaking like I put the plastic around like my stuff over here which is really great but like everything was like soaked like these boxes and stuff like when I when we got them into the new house they, some of them literally disintegrated when we put them onto the ground and they like stunk so we're trying to like unpack as fast as possible because the rain really soiled the boxes I don't know if you can hear right now but it's raining still right now so they were packing from like well yeah so I was at the old place from like 8 to 11 and then we came over here and they finished at like 3 and it took them a long time over here because at my new place the elevator is very very small like you can barely fit like one person in there with like a ton of stuff um and then with my bed I have a queen size bed and they somehow fit it outside the other place and the elevator with ease but then when they came here they had to like un undo it all and undo the couch and undo my um, roommate's bed and build it all again first of all I don't know how they remembered how to do that because I would not remember how to do that without instructions we did keep a, the instruction book out but like for the couch because we had it but for the beds we didn't have it which is funny because I didn't have so <laughs> I keep having so many stories upon stories um where was I with my tangent oh yeah so back to the moving so they had to undo everything and then they had to go up the stairs which I felt really bad but like you could not fit it anywhere else and that's why we did hire mover movers so that was that and then what else happened yeah I love the moving company that we use if you're ever in LA use adept moving they're my favorite ever because I use them every single time I move which as you guys know it's a lot and I'm not like sponsored or anything wish I was wish that was a thing but I really do recommend them because they are cheap and affordable for like you know a broke girl like yourself like myself yourself like myself they're very affordable they're very easy to work with they're always so so nice and they just get the job done and they don't complain they don't have like weird comments they don't say anything like they're just very very friendly people and that's what I really like surrounding myself by and having moving company that even like went through the rain and like all this other stuff to help us it just it was really really nice so that was that and then I went to Target we needed some paper towels so I got that and then I got I bought some salami I bought some chicken egg rolls like I literally was so hungry I didn't eat all, all day till like five and then what else did I buy I don't remember right now I'm like blanking oh I bought salad um and yeah and then I was like I really want Chipotle so on my way home I got Chipotle oh yeah I asked a while ago before I went on these tons of rambles um what are you liking in your what do you like to get at Chipotle um I always get the white rice I always get black beans I like getting the little veggies like the little like like peppers if you can see the peppers and onions and then most I usually get chicken that's usually the one I usually get but I will be adventurous and go try I'll sometimes get the steak or sometimes I'll get the tofu and then once I got the chorizo I like getting the corn I did realize that the corn has that extra kick of it I think it has jalapeno but for the longest time I never knew what that kick was <laughs> so I like the corn I like the sour cream um and I like the cheese so yeah that's my 
Chipotle order. I'm happy about this new place. It's I'm just so excited. It's rent controlled. It is smaller, but I do like that it's smaller. Um, nice area. Very nice commute to work. I'm really just trying to figure out what I want to do in my room. And I finally want to make this room like my room, like actually like decorate. Because every other place, I'm always like, I know I'm going to move. With this place, I have a lot of hope that I will stay here. <laughs> mm, but yeah. I hope you guys are having a great day. Um, I feel kind of like awkward eating and talking and kind of feel kind of rude eating and talking. But this is what the people like watching. So I'm like, okay. <laughs> but yeah. This is the last of my moving series, I think. I had two other ones uh, other than this. Only because I think I dragged it out enough. But yeah, I'm over the moving vlogs. Um, the next video you want, you will see. Well, I'm hoping you'll see because I have an idea. But I don't know when I'm going to upload it. But I want to do... <laughs> I'm going to do a video about like online or like app dating or online dating so that would be really fun i secured the bag <laughs> i bought some chips because i haven't bought chips in a long time and you know like when you're like i want to get this flavor but i know i'm gonna eat that flavor more but i will get this flavor because you think you want it that's just how i am i <laughs> We love an ASMR. Whatever. <laughs> They're good. What's your favorite chip flavor? I want to know that too down below. Let me know. My favorite ones are the ones that are like folded. Let me see if I can find one. I kind of ate like all of them earlier. <laughs> but I love the ones that are like folded. Did I really eat them all? Oh, I found one. Ooh, these are two stuck together. A two and one. Okay, I like these ones the most, where they're like little, they're like curled. I don't think that makes a difference, but I just like them better. I think I really did eat all the curly ones. Or I like the ones that have bubbles in them. Ooh. We'll have our last ship be the exciting one. Be our little curly one. Okay. I already ate half the bag. I got this today. Hello. Thanks for watching my mukbang. Thanks for watching my unboxing. Thanks for watching my apartment reveal. I'll re I'll reveal more of my apartment later. But yeah, that was my video. I hope you guys enjoyed. I love you guys so much. Thank you guys for whoever is watching. And please let me know what your favorite chip is down below and what you get at Chipotle. I would like to know that too because I could always try something new. Um, yeah. I'll talk to you later. Bye.